Okay, Hypercube viewers, we're back! Yay! For reals, like for really reals, we're back. And I know this isn't Dokemon Kingdom, but it's just as good. <laughs> if not better. We, mostly me, are playing Hataful Boyfriend. Yay! I cannot wait to play this. I have wanted to play this my whole life, really. I didn't know what I was missing <laughs> until, until I saw this game. All right, so, backstory for those of you. Uh, I am going to be attending St. Pidgeot Nation's school for birds. Uh, <laughs> it's an institute. It's not just a school. Yes. What should my name be? Uh, Chris Christina? You know how dating sims work? You gotta click through everything. No, I don't want that. <laughs> I don't want that. We, Justin, we need a bird-related Christina name. Oh. Yeah. Kestrolina. <laughs> I mean... I don't know if that'll fit. Kestrolina. Chris Starling. Ker Kestrolina. No, Kestrelli. <laughs> Castrelli. You uh, just be bird. <laughs> how about this? <laughs> bird girl. Bird girl. Wait, you need Wait, a number there, like you, like 52. You, you also need a third R. You need another R there. Yeah. Oh, come on! Nope. Wow! So, here's the thing. This is why I would get accepted to the school, because they're like, oh man, this human girl is all about it. She goes by bird girl. <laughs> we are accepting her. Oh! Oh okay. no, bird girl! 52! <laughs> well, how about I, I love birds? I love bird. <laughs> yeah, girl, bird I love girl, bird. I love bird. That's uh, my name! Wow. Okay, good. Is bird girl, I love bird okay? No, it's not. Uh, not okay. Yes. How do I tell them yes? Yes. Just keep, yeah, keep saying it out loud, though. Allowing even the birdiest of birds to appear as normal okay. humans. Uh, I think I want that. Yeah. I think you'll only see it for like a short amount of time and then there'll be birds. I don't know. I feel like we should just go No. Over. It gives me some context. Yeah. I thought you loved birds. I do, <laughs> but I'm not quite ready to let go of my human. All right, all right. Okay. Yeah, no, I feel you. I am, I am with you. Okay, I, I would good. need some, some human context yeah. before jumping into bird town. Exactly. I mean, I'm ready to jump into bird town. Oh, a school blessed with extensive curricula and facilities. Okay, we're gonna have to split up who does the voices for various birds. Just so you guys know, we're gonna be assigning some roles here. Okay. 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 By the way, is it August? Is it April eighth in the game, or is uh, it something else? It's April eighth in the game, even though it's April twenty first here. Weird. I don't know. Maybe that means something else. Who knows? Is that weird? I don't know. I don't know. It's April eighth. I don't know. I don't know. It's been a year since I ended my ordinary life and walked through these gates. Everything's crazy. I guess, yeah, it's, it's towards the end of the school year. Uh, I should probably say, the school is known for one thing in particular. The school is Japan's, no, the world's greatest <laughs> gathering place for gifted birds. Birds who want to study the arts, the sciences, even sports, all come to St. Pidgeot Nations. Uh, diverse blend of birds. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm often asked why I chose to come here, despite not being a bird. <laughs> I would hope that I get asked that often. That does seem like one of the things that they would ask you, like, uh, what, so what's your thing? Eh, it's a long story. Oh, okay. Not every day I see you rushing along like, oh, we don't know who this is yet. Ryota! Okay, who wants to be Ryota? Justin. Yeah. Okay, you're gonna be Ryota. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Usually you'd have been ready for an hour by now, bird girl. Overslept? Ha 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 ha. I think he's a good okay. guy. Oh, this wait. is what he looks like. <laughs> he's not a villain. Okay, I need to change his voice. This rock dove is named Kawada Ryota. We've been friends since he was barely hatched. Look at those red eyes. Yeah, because he can be a right. little mischievous. But he's responsible and kind. How can he be mischievous and responsible? Um, you just can. Okay, so he's not evil. I'm gonna change the, the word. Breakfast was a little hard to catch today. I can't relax without red meat inside. Why did Ooh, I say that? That's dirty. weird. <laughs> Living as a hunter-gatherer sounds tough. I'd be happy to make you breakfast, you know. <laughs> I might take you up on that offer when starvation lives. Thanks, Ryota. 
Ding dong! <laughs> you guys can't hear that because yeah, I have yeah. the headphones. Yeah. Oh, the bell already? Come on, we need to hurry to class. Oh, God. <laughs> Jeepers! No good being late on the first day. <laughs> Wait, the first day? Yeah, first day of school. Oh, maybe it's August 4th, because they do things backwards in the other countries. <laughs> oh, maybe, it's yeah. other countries, oh, things yeah. are backwards. <laughs> it was well, all the, I could do the, to adjust the, the atmosphere. Better make up for all that lost fun. I think we skipped over the actual backstory. No. I don't think we did. The I most think splendid just... and... Guys, the most splendid and greatest academy of the pigeon, by the pigeon and for the pigeon. And this one random girl who, for some reason, uh, goes to the school. Also, this picture is just like someone just went out to a park <laughs> and just took this picture. Um, I'm pretty sure um, Bird Girl, I Love Bird, is not just some random girl. <laughs> I think we're in 2-3. Ryota and I are in the same class again. Old faces, new faces. Old birds, <laughs> new birds. Hope we all get along. Here's the formation of many happy memories. Oh, do you want to be the teacher? Uh, obviously. Okay. Alright, we gotta do an evil voice. <laughs> Good morning, everybody! Uh, I'm Nanaki Kazuaki. I seem to be your teacher this year. I specialize in math and physics and also some other things. <laughs> Did you just fall asleep? <laughs> Sir, sir, wake up! Uh, we're in the homeroom. Homeroom. He sleeps with his eyes open. Oh, I it up. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, we got some hot teacher syndrome. I'm a hot teacher. Going on You're over here. You're actually a hot quail. Yeah, <laughs> hot quail teacher. You're like a... God, look at these curls. Ooh. I'm into that. <laughs> He's well known as a mathematician. Just goes to show, great minds come in all forms. Especially quails. And hot and, teachers. And sleepy. Ah, oh, I'm sorry. Isn't it a little warm in here? I don't know why our hot teacher sounds like he's like 90. Uh, I'm, not, I'm not 90, he's just really awkward. Yeah. Which reminds me, we have a tr tr transfer student. Please introduce yourself, Shiragane. Oh, I guess I'll be Shiragane. No, Sakuya. Is it the same person? Probably. Okay. What is the point? <laughs> I have no wish to speak with commoners. Do not think I'm here because I wish to be. <laughs> no, well, I guess that's that. <laughs> hey, hey, it's no good. We are supposed to be in class. <laughs> But he doesn't want to introduce himself. It would be awkward. But we can't just let him break the rules like that, sir. The system will collapse and we'll all turn into Kulix and dissenters. What does that even mean? <laughs> I don't know. That might, that might be an offensive term. Or a bird term. I don't know what I've just said. Uh, well, when you put it like that, could you at least say your name, Shirogane? <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> Shirogane. Dot, dot, dot. Dot dot. <laughs> Shirogane le bel sakuya. <laughs> um, that's like a weird, like Flitwick. Oh man, oh, like, he's hot. It's like um, name, and he's like, first of Flitwick, I've I've been you've been my teacher for five years. <laughs> it doesn't matter, Potter. I need to know your name. <laughs> <laughs> it seems this fan tale is Shirogane sakuya. His feathers would make any birdie proud. He's pretty stuck up, but then transferring is never easy. I hope we can be friends. <laughs> Glaring daggers. Why? It's Why gonna be trouble dick? down the line. The little, the little bird is telling you that there's like gonna the, be trouble down the line. You the missed the pun. On, he's you have one oh, Sorry, it's lunch already. Time's just slipping by so quickly. He is the Draco. Sorry, I was too busy tweeting to, uh, <laughs> to get that joke. I forgot which way the camera was. I looked over there. <laughs> I've had these books out from the library all summer. Oh, we're going to the library. Uh-oh. I bet there's going to be, like, a quiet loner right, hanging I, out in the library. I call library bird. There's hardly any birdie here. Huh? <laughs> Is someone looking at me? 
probably just my imagination. Yeah, you can't tell because their eyes are on the sides of their head, so it's hard to know if they're like <laughs> looking at you or just something off to the yep. 90 degrees. A morning dove stands in a dark corner, staring in my direction. Oh, he's emo morning dove. Morning doves aren't very common in Japan, but apparently they're everywhere in America. That's racist. Um, did you want something from me? <laughs> <laughs> Dot, dot, dot. <laughs> he looked away. Not really. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty sure it was him who I felt looking at me. There's no one else here. Are you sure? <laughs> yes. I don't want anything with you. <laughs> what a dick. It's the thing you're carrying that I'm interested in. Give me that book. Hurry up and return them already. No, I've had these all summer and I want them even more. Uh, oh, oh, sorry. <laughs> they were a little too dense and I never finished them. <laughs> yeah, bird economics is... Were you waiting for them all summer? Bird economics? Dot, dot, dot. He silently returns his gaze to the book. His book. Maybe he's in a bad mood. I'm Isle of Bird Bird Girl, a <laughs> sophomore. What about you? <laughs> I'm happy with our life choices. <laughs> Me too. I have no regrets. <laughs> I hope I get to introduce myself more. <laughs> You're... Nageki. Fujishiro. Nageki. <laughs> Freshman. Shaken, not stirred. <laughs> I, I don't know why I oh, was, you quiet. know, waiting for the book all summer <laughs> since I'm a freshman. Look how, like, sad and sad he is. <laughs> Maybe it's just his voice, but he seems kind of sad. <laughs> Probably just the voice. It's not the voice. <laughs> <laughs> Leave me alone! <laughs> He's reading his book again. Okay, sorry to bother you. We go back to reading Harry Potter book five. <laughs> I keep meeting depressing people today. <laughs> you would read Harry Potter book five, sad, sad Nagaki. Now that I have that out of the way, I think I'll head back to class. Wait, isn't that... Dot dot dot. Oh no! You should have been instructed not to approach me in school. Is this one me? No. Yep, I... you're Yuya. Come on, Sakia. What kind of thing is that to say to your own <laughs> brother? After all these years! My brother? You must be joking. You've never once been a brother to me. Please, Please. Oh, don't try turn. to- Don't take my life! <laughs> no brother of mine would take my life! Sorry, bro! Don't try to talk to me again! I've no time for half-breeds! He is Draco. <laughs> I'll be going now to the beat of this intense music that just started playing. <laughs> I'll have to take your word for it, man! <laughs> hey, wait, Jesta! Forgot what I was gonna say! <laughs> I guess even if we're in the same school now, what's done is done. Oh my god, what did he do to curse his brother? I hadn't meant to eavesdrop, but I think I just overheard something juicy. This is really awkward, by the way. Our faces are totally in the way of my uh, face. Uh, oh yeah. <laughs> That's okay, we're more attractive That's, than the birds. You'll have to trust yep. us. The ever popular trendsetter and ladies man, Sakazaki? Yuya? Is Saki his brother? <laughs> I mean, they Sorry, have... we're not great. We, we've taken like a collective like 10 years of Japanese, we're still not great at no. it. <laughs> Sometimes there's just a lot of syllables. They both <laughs> have, they, they've taken a collective 10 years as well, so I'm just bringing the, the, the average down. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder what the story behind that is. Eh. <gasps> <gasps> Exclamation point! You heard that whole thing, oh, right? Just so you guys know, the music just got a lot more easygoing. Obviously. Yeah, this is gonna be an easy, good conversation. Are you a friend of Sakia's? I, I, I'm sorry. Was there an earthquake? I just don't know. Happened. Something just happened. Just happened. <laughs> I didn't mean to listen in on you. <laughs> Exclamation point? Question mark. It looks like we're in the train car of uh, <laughs> Hogwarts Express. No sweat. <laughs> <laughs> I try to stay sexy and suave in front of all you little ladies, but that there wasn't too cool. 
I picked the perfect voice for this guy. Yeah, I know. Just, just like I love off it. the cuff. Oh, he doesn't look like a surfer at all, though. Uh, yeah, yeah. But look, yeah, but look at the tie. Yeah, he's yeah. on the tie. Okay. He's also this got, like, and the berets. Is, yeah. <laughs> Sakazaki Yuya, an upperclassman. <laughs> I've never talked to him before, but he's famous or infamous throughout the school. Every birdie knows of him. Because there's only like 12 of us. It's yeah. really... <laughs> You're bird girl, right? <laughs> <laughs> how, how did you... I know everybody here. Besides, you're the only human? <laughs> a single poppy in a field of rye. Is that a compliment? <laughs> Did you say you were a friend of Sakia's? Not exactly. We had a rather ballistic <laughs> introduction this morning. <laughs> we're in the same class. That's all. I'd never have thought that stuck-up aristocrat wannabe was your brother. <laughs> aristocrat wannabe. He is an aristocrat, actually. <laughs> the genuine article in the flesh. He is? He's a bit of a pain, so good luck, mon ami. Adieu. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think that, this guy's kind of a douchebag. Yep. He, uh, he really is a noble bird. Yeah, that, was, that was a good one, Joe. <laughs> I've never heard anything like that about Yuya, though. Probably a twisty business. <laughs> what does that mean? I don't know. Oh, guys, it's the end of the school day. Oh, that's all for today. Stay safe, everyone. Wait, that was... I'm wondering that's okay. Oh, okay. if maybe this would be a good time to end the episode. Because that's all for today. Yeah. Also, yeah, that was not me. That was you. No, it's Sorry. okay. It's, it's okay. You want to do that's it. all no, for today. Stay I was, safe, everyone. I was sleeping. So oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, so this has been Hot Tiffle Boyfriends. We're going to play much more of this game, whether you like it or not. <laughs> <laughs> so you should probably just get on board with it now. Just yeah. like you did with Dokapone. Nobody liked Dokapone to start. Everybody always loved Dokapone. Like that's, Dokapone. True. <laughs> that's true. Um, this game is hilarious. I think there's actual like choices, like actual game further in. Uh, it doesn't matter. We are already I'm yeah. already enjoying it. We've this. made our choices. We've made very strong <laughs> character made choices. choices. Yes. Bird related choices. Yes. So, that's all. We'll be back soon with another episode. We're going to be playing some other games coming up. We're super happy to be back. Thank you guys for watching. We'll see you next time. Team, Team Hypercube, Hypercube out! out.